snap and there we go what's up guys here with another vlog today i'll be cleaning the tv remote control as it is pretty obvious that i cleaned this tv now you can see the shine and now i forgot to mention but you can see there are some lit little scratches now those are not scratches from the microfiber towel and you might get critical scratches you can see there's a fingerprint right there i can just buff it off with a microfiber tablet if I, or just my finger but after you've cleaned your screen it should look like a black screen because it's turned off because the full blink device as you guys know so i was looking in my videos let me just turn off this light so you guys can see me better plus the lights are getting in my eye oh my gosh I'd how do I? There we go. Okay, so as I was saying, in my last video, from like three months ago, or th no, three weeks ago. So first, I solved the Rubik's cube video. Have you guys seen that already? Next, what I did, I told you about the TV, and I told you the blinking lights. In the end, I put a Nintendo Switch onto it, and then it did power on. And guys, I, was, I just want to give you the answer to this question. From my last video, um, you guys might have um, answer, um, questions in your head. Like, is the water going to damage your TV? If, yes, yes. Like, I'm going to tell you straight off, yes. Now, I did put water on the top. Now, these seals, well, it doesn't, the TV doesn't get ruined. Don't worry about that. Don't freak out. But these gaps are closed so what happens is the water goes in here there's no gap there's no gap there's a small gap which which just has dust and then behind that there's a sticky now that sticky will just peel off and then you can just glue it back on that which is easy to do like you can see i pull this off really much i can stick it back on even the glue is not tough you can see it does hold pretty tight and this, this is the buzzer board. That's the case. That covers it. Now you can see my TV is actually shining if you go really back. And you guys are wondering, how did my other phone connect it with this one? This phone is actually been charging for pretty much the whole day. So yeah. So what I did in that video is I turned it on. I didn't know. It was getting power, yes? So I was like... I showed you. I showed you guys those switches. So if you go here, I'll be show. These are the switches. And let me just get my light on. The main problem. So these switches do work, in fact. And you have your serial and O down here. If you can't find your serial number, I'm not gonna show you my serial number. But you see that shaded part? That's X. So next, you can see this is in 50 hertz EX720. Now all of the TV don't have the same same serial number. You already know this, but if you don't, just in case, don't freak out. Every TV don't doesn't have the same thing exists. Now what I showed you in that other video when I did power on that this indicator was on is red and then when it power on it just goes green and then it goes here then blinks blinks blink then that happens now i just wonder there's another here now what is this button thing for i i actually don't know because i've only seen this go to green this green one is on all, all the time i've never seen this one being on i think this is for an alarm which will beep tv and then it'll make uh, like an alarm now, if I take my chair, look at me sitting. I'm holding the phone and I'm doing some VYD. Guys, tell me, what is the picture quality now? This, 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 x ray. If you can see x ray, this is how the TV looks like. This is how I look like. Okay. 
back to the TV, you can see it looks like, I don't even know what to say. It looks white. Everything, you can see my x-ray, this is blue, this is blue. And my fingers are blue. Are the wrong color, they're supposed to be brown. Oh, I'm not, oh, oh my god, this looks so sick. Oh my god, this Rubik's Cube, this is yellow. And this is red. How did it change to blue? I don't even understand. This is, this is not yellow. It looks really shiny, but it's not. How the, this is orange. How is this, wait, what? Okay, let's see what's the white face. Oh my God. Oh my God, what the? Let's see what is the remote. Oh my God, oh my God. Bro, <laughs> this doesn't even look like IRL. Bro, my iPad doesn't even look good. Look. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. I am not <laughs> diving into My MacBook looks ugly now. Everything looks ugly. Oh my god. Holy. This, what about this? Oh my. Okay, enough of that filter. Which was a bit cool. Yes, everything is done. So what I did in that video, I left it on for a few minutes. Right? I told you guys about these ports that I'm going to turn on my camera that keeps switching it on and off. So now you can see all of this. And then I did press this twice. So let's pray that this will work. Go to the TV. Turn off the nail power off. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, enough of this. Um, let's make a remote control clean. Part two. 